You're watching Fusion, a collaboration between Millennium Magazine and On Deck with Lucy. This show gets you behind the scenes of all of Millennium Mag's incredible interviews and asks the exciting and edgy questions that On Deck is known for. Fusion gets you closer to your favorite celebrities while giving you another angle to view our incredible guests. Hi, I'm Lucy and you're watching Fusion and today we are joined by top family attorney, TV personality, top selling author and CEO of DivorceDating.com, Miss Vicky Ziegler. Vicky, it's so, so great to have you here. Um, we're in Central Park at the moment and I'm very excited to hear about this wonderful book, The Premarital Planner. What was the transition and, and how did it come about from being a divorce lawyer to going across and becoming an author? Well, I think everyone thought I was crazy because why would I write a book trying to help people stay happily married when I'm a divorce attorney? But for me, it was important to take the knowledge that I've learned from all of my clients and help impart wisdom to people that were actually getting married. I think that that's what's so amazing to me is that you are wanting to help people. You do want to educate people. So let me give you an example. If I was engaged, if I was engaged, what, yeah, maybe, maybe. <laughs> what three <laughs> tips would you give me um, to help protect myself and my finance as well? Well, I think the first and most important tip would be get emotionally and financially naked. What does that mean? I want you to tell me the good, the bad, the ugly. What's going on in that skeleton, those closets that you have, all those skeletons that are hidden? Just be honest, get it out, it helps. Financially as well, what's your FICO score? I don't want anyone marrying someone if they don't know what their finances are, what their debt looks like. You really wanna to impart to somebody that you need to be honest going into the marriage. And the third thing is kind of an easy one, but people don't really implement it. Put your partnership first. It's not me, it's not you, it's we. And when you do that, I think you're going into a marriage with open eyes, an open heart, and you're really on the right step. I think we have a major epidemic in this country, and that's people getting divorced. Statistics, as we talked about before, one out of two marriages fail, and that's first time. Second time, it's 63%. Third time marriages fail, Lucy, at a rate of 73%. Why is it so high? I think money, um, communication, religion, um, people not being equipped to understand the tools and skills needed to be in a relationship, not talking about those important issues, um, coming from different backgrounds, the way you're raised about money and the way you see money and do you save, do you spend. Those are all of the things that people need to start talking about. We can help as a society. You can read books that educate the premarital planner, but not only, there are so many, else, so many other books like that. You know what, you can go to therapy or you can have a life coach if things aren't going right. We need to work with experts if there are issues that we need to really focus on. And it's okay, you know what, we're not perfect. And that's okay, that's the beauty of who we are. You may be. Um, I'm not, close, but not really. Um, and you know what, that's okay. You know what, express yourself, be who you are and do it collectively. That to me is really important. So I think we can as a whole teach people, you know what, don't run and get married if you're 18. Don't Just take it easy. Get to know who you are. Get to learn about yourself. Learn about your partnership. What I like there, what you just said that, um, you know, we're not perfect. And as a TV analyst, you talk about what we see as perfection, which is celebrities such as Kim Kardashian, and they're going through these divorces. And how do you think that you are able to affect um, the public from being able to talk about celebrities' divorce? I really want the public to understand what goes on in a divorce, how difficult it is. It may look like it's this easy fix. If you're not working it out and you're married and you're Kim Kardashian, you can just get divorced in 72 days, but you see they're still not divorced and it's been almost a year. So things don't just happen overnight. I wanna educate people, let them understand the process, how difficult it is. And I think I wanna give them the lay, lay person's take on it. I don't come off like I'm this big lawyer. Hey, you wanna know what a pleading is, what a petition is, and this is what's going on, and these are the ramifications. I like to speak so everyone can understand it. You don't need a law degree to understand what I'm saying. And that's important. And I try to take a, a kind of an honest approach to what's going on. I don't sugarcoat it. And I never say anything I don't believe. I'm looking at you. I have never seen a lawyer so glamorous than Vicky right now. Now, Vicky, I also have my own web show called On Deck with Lucy. And with Fusion, we incorporate the three T's of New York, um, the talent, trends, and taste, which is what we ask in the web show. So I'm going to run the three T's by you right now before we <laughs> before we finish. Um, when it comes to talent, I'd like to say that you're representing talent right now. What's the key to your success here in New York? I honestly think believing um, in what you say and do, your passion, being honest and, and true to who you are, and 
honestly working hard. I don't think anybody gets anything that's handed down to them where they don't really uh, flourish and they don't really believe that they're worth it. You work hard, honestly, and play hard because I like to have a good time. I like that answer. <laughs> now, when it comes to trends, we've seen online dating become a huge trend when it comes to relationships. Do you see any new dating trends take place in 2013? You know what? We're seeing a lot of people meeting um, at locations instead. They meet online, and then all of a sudden they'll meet at a specific space. I think that's going to be happening more and more. I think people are going to have these divorce parties, which I started about 10 years ago. Oh. Um, so I'm actually really happy that the trend is really picking up. Um, and I think people are going to be webcamming more. They're going to be sending videos more and more because the technology is just becoming amazing online. And before we finish up, give us a taste of what's yet to come from yourself and also a taste of your um, website, which is divorcedating.com. Yes, that is my beloved site. I created this site when a client came to me and said, how do I meet people? I'm not in the social scene. So I created divorcedating.com for people that have been affected by divorce. Um, if you're single and wouldn't mind dating somebody that's divorced as well, and that's really a place where divorcees can meet. You have something in common before you start. You're gonna see that all over. We're gonna start in New York and we're gonna have parties all over the country. And I am so excited because people really need to meet people and they need to have something in common before they start and that's the website to go to. Excellent. Now for uh, viewers out there who want to find out more information about your book, let's hold it up. And also um, maybe they want to contact you with any questions. What's yes. the best way to do that? And also give them your uh, uh, Twitter account oh, yeah. thing because I'm following her. She's oh. great. So. Yes, my Twitter account is Vicki Ziegler, V-I-K-K-I-Z-I-E-G-L-E-R. Um, you can go on my website and you can email me. It's VickiZiegler.com. And the premarital planner is at Barnes & Noble throughout the country.